everybody is talking about Bruce Jenner. You flip on the news, the ESPYs, open a magazine, and he's there. Bruce Jenner is a transgendered, male to female, who is making headlines everywhere as he publicizes his transformation and sheds light on the controversial topic of transgender. Let's explore his journey by taking a look at his early life, the transition, and how it affects our society. Bruce Jenner first caught our attention at the 1976 Summer Olympic Games, where he received a gold medal and became the new world record holder for the decathlon. From there, he became a national figure, appearing on TV shows, doing endorsements, and according to Biography.com, became one of the only seven spokesmen for Wheaties. More recently, he is known for his role on the hit TV show, Keeping Up with the Kardashians, where he stars alongside his now former wife, Kris Jenner, and both their children and stepchildren. So now that we know how Bruce came to fame, let's talk about how he became Caitlyn right before our eyes. In April 2015, after mass tabloid speculation about the subtle changes in his appearances, Bruce made his first public announcement about being transgender. In an exclusive interview with Diane Sawyer, Bruce told the world that he identifies himself as a woman and is attracted to them still too. According to abcnews.com, Jenner claims that he has been living a lie his entire life, and now that he can finally be free that it's out in the open. After receiving facial feminization surgery, which includes changes to the jaw, the cheeks, the hairline, and the forehead, Jenner appeared on the Vanity Fair issue in July debuting himself as Caitlyn for the whole world to see. So what does Caitlyn mean for our society? Early this month at the 2015 SB Awards, she received the Arthur Ashe Award for Courage for not only her athletic achievements, but for her public struggle with her transition. She used her acceptance speech to promote acceptance and tolerance and called out the treatment that is given to transgenders today, especially with the youths who are being bullied, murdered, or even committing suicide. Unfortunately, she has received much backlash, including people who call the whole thing a big publicity stunt. After all, she has her own TV show now, I Am Kate, that had premiered earlier this week. According to the Washington Post, there's also a conspiracy theory that the only reason she won the award in the first place was that because ABC aired both her interview with Diane Sawyer and the SBs, and that they did it to get their own tabloid ratings. Bruce Jenner's transformation came as a shock to most, as the former macho male athlete is now sporting dresses and makeup. Although some question his motives, he has undoubtedly informed the community on the topic of transgender and inspired people to be who they truly are inside.